Welcome back to the Man United stream, hope you're doing well, we've got huge breaking news and it's to do with the new manager of Man United, yes Ruben Omerin is now officially the new Man United manager starting his job in the international break that we're getting in November, oh my god this is huge news, this is massive news, I mean the worst thing about it is that we have to wait all the way to the mid-November to see him in action, but actually is it that, that bad I'm not quite sure because yesterday we had Ruud van Nistelrooy take over at United as caretaker of a manager and what a game it was 5-2 against Leicester City and just the gameplay just the way in which all the players were up for the game just running for the manager is what you wanted to see why was that not there when Ten Hag was was manager that is the biggest question most fans had there so look everyone who was sporting Ten Hag saying look Ten Hag in Ten Hag should stay. This is the reason why some of us decided enough's enough. The manager is to blame and someone has to give way. Either the players have to leave or the manager has to go. It's easier to get rid of the manager and start the rebuild that way than to just get rid of your entire squad. That is our thought process on this. I know, I know there'll be lots of you out there who probably don't agree with this, who probably feel that the manager should always stay in his job and we should have continued with Ten Hag and we should have sort the players out but that was going to be a long hard struggle and Ten Hag we all knew was not good at man management and these days football is all about man managing you know getting along with the players making sure that they fulfill their potential making sure they're happy and we knew Ten Hag has fell out with loads and loads of players had an issue with man managing all these top players Sancho, Ronaldo the list carries on and on so we knew we needed a new, new, new manager and Ruud van Nistrooy, look what he did. Look what he did to these players. I mean, even Casemiro scoring two goals, almost scoring a hat-trick. What was all that about? There's clearly players in that squad who are happy and relieved that Ten Hag is out and they're getting a new manager. And I was watching the game yesterday thinking players like Dalo and Bruno Fernandes, who are of course Portuguese, will also benefit from Omerin coming in. Now going back to Ruben Omerin, the Portuguese coach will start his chapter during the international break. Documents have all been signed and delivered. Everything has been sorted. We know and we've heard that the contract for Ruben Omrin will go to 2027 and Sporting will receive a compensation package of around 10 million euros plus 1 million for the staff and 30 days notice. That is what we're hearing. This is great news for Man United having gone out there and secured the new manager and this manager let it be known everybody had tapped on to this manager they were all tracking him all the clubs all the big clubs in Europe wanted Ruben Omrin I mean we're talking about Liverpool we're talking about Man City as well who were all had made inquiries with him and were waiting for the right time to go in and get him this is fantastic news for Man United what do you think of this drop your comments below are you happy with the new signing of the new manager or do you think someone else would have been better players to take over at United maybe even Ruud van Nistrooy drop your comments below let us know what you think make sure you hit the like button on this video make sure you subscribe you're watching the Man United stream channel